Hey, welcome back to Northern Ants Gaming. Ostriv. Riv. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, we are going to continue our, our little community today. See how we're doing. See if we can't get enough houses built for the winter time. Plus, we got to start looking at getting some food production going. Seeing it is October already. Uh, hopefully, we have a lot of food stored up because I'm not look not seeing too many possibilities for producing food. Which it would be kind of nice if we could hunt. If there was like deer in the woods and stuff, that would help for a food source. I don't have the time. I don't think to get a fishing dock. Built. I've got the boathouse and the fishing dock on the agenda, but I still need four more houses before the winter comes or the people just leave. So let's uh, let's get another house with the with the garden set up. kind of on the hill here, but uh, let's see. Oh, shoot. I hit F. Okay. Oh, it's on even ground. I was wondering if I was just pushing the wrong button or something. Uh, let's see if we could stick it over here. Unfortunately, as it's recording, my it's nice and smooth as I'm recording, but for some reason, as you can probably tell, it's kind of jittery on the recording end of it. It might be a little better seeing I've got the speed down a little bit more, but we will see. Where is she going? Or he? She? Yeah, she... Oh, okay, she's the one for the thatch. Try not to move too quickly around the map. That might help. So it's not quite so janky. They're pretty much... Pretty close to being done with this house. Let's take a look at it. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. Okay. Yeah. And I noticed that these houses that I put up later are not getting their farms put in. Because it's just too late. Only three more houses are needed. Uh, we need to we need to move this up. Because we got to get two more now. Let's let's put two on two more houses without. on some room and I'll do one more can we get it right here let's turn it around because we the, the door facing the other way okay and let's move these all to the front of the list. Okay, let's speed up the time. Kind of just take a look back. Because the farther away I think it made so it would actually uh, run a little smoother. Actually, I, kind of, I sure looked. I thought we started with like nine hundred ninety-nine dollars, and we're up to eighteen. So we must be making money somewhere. Let's 
the other thing that we can do too is with the forestry we can plant trees actually let's let's set up a spot we click uh shoot oh i guess it's there there that'll be good that'll give us another spot oh good and they'll start planting right away so it'll keep our resources up because once they chop down all these trees we need to have some backup because I don't want to be trying to travel to find trees how many people we have working here two let's uh, nah. I was gonna say throw another person on there but we need them working on building these houses because it's already November now. And we still need, well, this one will make two to we'll have two that we need still. I'm just hoping we have enough food stored up to survive the winter. Oh, okay, I put that one first. I love how the, the things start changing color. You can see the grass is starting to change brown. It's like a race against time. for these first houses. Once we get our, our community set up with the enough houses for the people we already have, then we can work on those other buildings. The lumber camp is really important though because you get, you know, we need those for the lumber for, the, for building, plus you need wood for fires for the winter time when it's cold. It'll be interesting to see how long it takes those trees to actually grow, too. Uh, family moved out because of cold. Oh, no. Didn't get the... December started, two families moved out because of the cold, so we lost. It figures they're just going to finish this house, too. We would have been able to keep one of them. So we went from 30 people down to 23 people. Well, at least come spring, we'll have two more houses, so they should be able to get moved back in. Yeah, it looks like one of my workers that was at the lumber camp probably is one of the people that moved out. Nice thing is, in come spring, we do have a farm set up and a field, so we'll be able to start producing food there. And hopefully, over the winter time, we'll be able to get these. Uh, the fishing stuff completed beforehand. That way we can start getting food production. Hmm. Where did I set? Okay, this is for the this is the well because they are pretty far away from the water. So actually, let's get them working on the well quick. Uh, 
It'll make it easier on them being closer to it. I love that. It's got transporters. They bring the stuff into the well. And then people will come behind and build it then. I think those are like a tan color, the clay, but with the snow, it's actually, when they're sitting there for a little bit, they actually get snow cover on them. Which same way with the, with all of it, that's pretty cool, because it is snowing. Nice more than one person was working on this house, so it would get done a lot quicker. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. Uh, now we got three. Asking you will receive, right? <laughs> well, I think they looks like they've got plenty of materials there to finish it. I think if we can we click on it and see. Okay, it shows up here the progress. This is all the, the nails, the workers, the clay, the thatch. Oh, we've got five builders working on it. And hopefully now that we'll have two extra houses over the amount of people there, they will actually some will move back in come spring, hopefully. Hmm. You know, Mary, when you commented that it was they build those houses fast, now that I've been sitting and watching, it doesn't feel quite so fast. <laughs> they do build them quick, but... When you watch it, it's not as fast as it as you needed it. I needed it to be faster because of the fact that we did lose two people. But final stages, putting up the roof. Nice. Not enough food for sale. Oh, okay. The house it says not enough food for sale. Jobs available need now they should start working not enough workers to chop trees oh yeah because the one had moved out they should be starting to work on the boat yard now good Yeah, it's January now, so not too credibly long before the starts warming up again. Cause we got to get the boat yard done so we can get somebody working on building. Because we need to get, I think it's two boats for the fishing dock. Because then we can get the fish, which is a good source of food for the people. Now, hopefully, I set up my production facilities good enough to where we won't run out of supplies before we need them to well we don't need them to run out of supplies but we don't want them hopefully the supply chain is strong enough to supply what we need actually I'm going to let's see let's add another field so we have two fields going We can actually attach and 
there, so they, they group together. Yeah, let's see, I think we've got a wheat for that one. Let's see what else can we do. Buckwheats, potatoes. We could do potatoes. That's probably a good one to do because uh, starches and stuff for the people. We'll activate that one. Yeah, see this one we've got wheat, which we'll need. Uh, I didn't really build that quite good, did I? <laughs> a little lopsided. We won't assign anybody until probably, uh, let's say, April. Oh, nice. Okay, the boatyard is done. Let's get one. Let's get it, somebody working on that. So I think we have to have the fishing to actually order a boat. Yeah, so once we get the fishing building done, then we will be able to order a boat. And then that person will build it. Okay, let's see, what do we want next? Production. The windmill. We got a coal pile stone camp. Oil. Let's see, don't need that. We've got plenty of houses right now. We need clothing, but we need animals to produce those. So let's uh let's build a windmill because we're gonna need that for when our straw is done. Or not our straw, I mean our wheat to make uh flour to make bread and I want to get the church up let's see we can do a burial spot and place to pray that's an important part uh, let's see where do we want to set that let's just put it right let's just put it right here kind of localize it Carts are wearing out. We need a, a carpenter. Okay, production. We need a carpenter because our we need those carts because that. Okay, let's our production stuff can be over on this side a little more. Space occupied. Yeah, we can put it there. We'll just need to cut two trees. Okay, let's speed up the speed a little bit. Get them building that a little quicker. See, it? see, it's still clicking to hire somebody. I've got it hot. I got them set to be there, but there's not enough people. How fast those trees are growing! Yeah, still small. It'll be a while before those are ready to be harvested. You know, and you have different facilities that you can take people off of if you need to. Like the fishing right now, there's no sense of having somebody on the fishing hut with the river frozen. They're not going to be able to fish anyway. So, but we can all we can do this. We can, oh, we can get three. Let's order three boats. Let's get two people working on them so we because we can always pull those off the boats. Once the boats are done, then we can pull the people off of that too and put them on the fishing. Get that windmill started, that's good. All these production facilities are not going to be in use right now, and they're not used all the time, but it will be good to have them for different parts of the time. Okay, good, we got the windmill done. Oh, we might want more wheat than that. That's a pretty small field. You can also use these fields as like, you can chain them to like a cow pasture and they can use it. Oh good, okay we got our chapel. And now somebody will start working on the carpentry. Oh, 
look at yeah that's, that's cool you can tell it's warming up you can watch the the snow starting to melt off of the off the houses plus our river is open so we can once we get some boats we can get some people fishing can't complete the order in the winter okay so now they can start working on them we're gonna want three people fishing so let's get three people going on that as soon as these boats get going see now the boat's done they'll go over and they'll deliver it and then we'll bring a person in to start fishing and hopefully now that it's spring again we will have Oh good, we got farmers. Let's, we gotta hire some farmers here. Cause we need them out working the fields right now. If we get as many people in here as we can, hopefully they'll prioritize things like this. Okay, good. Yeah, they're out there planting the potatoes. That's a really good thing to have going for the next season. And these guys, the ones with the houses with the own farms, they should start working on their own production too. Oh yeah, that's cool. It shows what they have. Dried fish. It's got pretty good food stores right now. But that won't last long. It... It only lasts for a certain amount of time. They've got a pretty good variety. They get, looks like raspberries and onions. I'm definitely allergic to onions, so you can't... I wouldn't have those in my house. <laughs> Let's see, how many boats? Do we have all three already? Only... Wait, why didn't they work on the next one yet? Let's slow it down a little bit. Might not be quite so janky then. See, everybody right now is working on the farm, so they're not really paying attention to building anymore. Education. We might want to get a school going pretty quickly. Let's see what's the... what's. Let's see... Children 10 to 15 years of age can apply for primary school education if their parents are inclined to educate their children. The primary school gives the basic skills to legitimacy and numerous required to apply to manager. Okay. Yeah. We might as well get that set up because that will help in the long run. I figure out where to put it. Let's see. Yeah, I don't want to make the kids walk too far from. Let's put it back here. Right behind all the houses. That'll be good. Oh good, yeah, see they're starting to work on their farms. Anybody out fishing yet? No. Let's keep our eye on the farms if they finish. We can take take some of these people off. Let's, let's just put two on, so it'll be one for each farm right now. And we don't really need anybody in here yet because we don't have any. Well, unless, well, maybe we have some wheat. Yeah, no. We're gonna wait until the till the crops have grown. We need these guys to get fishing. But their carts are wearing out too. We need the agate yeah, seals are almost completely wore out. How can can we prioritize? Oh, they're already starting to work on it. I 
Okay, well, hey, we are got pretty good going on here. We got got set up for our fishing. We've got enough houses for people. Hopefully, some will move back in. Uh, crops are growing. Okay, well, we're going to leave it off right there. I uh, hope you enjoyed the episode today. Remember to hit that like button, comment down below, and hopefully I will see your, hopefully you'll subscribe. I would appreciate it very much. You have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments. Don't forget to check out the Northern Ants merch shop. The link is in most of the descriptions of the videos, plus on my homepage. Thank you.